I'm happy to be here in Cardiff. Um, uh, this is a great town. I, I took my wife out today for lunch and went through the city and um, it's really cozy. That's what's really cool about it. I, I really, really dig the way uh, you guys have the setup and the restaurants and, and there's a mall right there and right near my hotel, which was really convenient. A little bit of a different tour, I imagine, than what you used to. I mean, uh, r rather than being in the ring every evening, you're, you're up on stage. How's the body holding up a little bit better this time? Yeah, yeah, it's a lot easier. I, you know, you, you, it's good to know you can actually use your brain uh, instead of your body all the time. Uh, uh, it, it's still hard. I mean, you, we're still traveling city to city. It's a few hours each day, but um, I enjoy it. I enjoy talking to the fans. Uh, I think it's... Uh, it's a lot more fun for me. Um, I don't know if it is for the fans, but uh, I get a lot more satisfaction out of it. And it's, it's a lot easier to get responses from the fans when you're talking to them rather than just wrestling. Now we know you had a hugely esteemed amateur wrestling career before going into the pro ring. Was there uh, any other sports on your horizon that maybe was in your future? Well, I was an uh, all-state football player in high school and I had to make the choice between football and wrestling and I obviously chose wrestling. Uh, it was a smart decision on my part. Um, I believe that either one I would have done, I would have done really, really well, whether it had been pro football or, or the Olympics in wrestling, but I like the one-on-one -on -one competition. So for me, I was more comfortable going out there and, and doing it on my own. It's not something really um, we get offered in school in this country as amateur wrestling, yeah, but... Yeah, it's crazy. Um, in the United States, it's offered to everybody. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, that's why uh, a lot of wrestlers, are, you know, a lot of coaches from MMA are recruiting wrestlers. Um, you you have the option in the United States to uh, be taught wrestling for free. Uh, you don't have to go to a club and pay a club owner or, or a trainer. You go to your high school, your junior high, your elementary school, your college, you're being taught wrestling. So it's a very, very mainstream sport in the United States. Finally, for me, I'm not sure if it's comparable at all, but what gave you the biggest buzz in your career? Being stood on that podium, being handed a gold medal at the Olympics or stepping out in the cathedral that was Madison Square Garden? I Honestly, nothing will ever compare to the Olympic gold medal. Uh, standing on the podium, representing my country, winning a gold medal, having to put around my neck, uh, that was the proudest moment of my life, besides having my kids, but the the, the sure fact that you can, that you know that you're the best, the best in the world uh, in amateur wrestling or any sport is a great feeling.